Hey everyone, we're playing another Flash game today. We're playing one of the favorites. If you look up like top 10 Flash games of all time, for some reason this game is always on that list. So today we're going to go ahead and give it a whirl. I know it's a slightly harder game, so I'm going to try to put my, uh, my gamer boots on right now. So let's go ahead and get started. New game. So we get dropped off. We don't have too much instruction, but um, we forget to refuel you on the way over. Drive over to the fuel station to fill her up. It's been impossible to hire decent miners on Mars since all the strange activity. That's why we're willing to pay you a premium for your services. I've given you a basic mining machine to get started with. Unfortunately, you'll be on your own from this point onward as the settlers who were lucky enough to escape with their lives have fled to safety. However, all of the shops here have been computerized, so you'll still be able to sell your minerals, fuel up, upgrade your pod, and buy special items. Remember, your job is to collect minerals and bring them to the surface for processing. The deeper you dig, the more valuable the minerals you'll encounter. Don't forget to refuel. Good luck. Okay, so we are just a miner. We go over here to refuel. Go ahead and fill up our tank. So we got to go and... Um... Oh, I got to click okay. We got to go get minerals. So let's go into the ground. Go into the ground. Now, the thing about this game... Um, it actually wasn't one that I played as a child. But I have played it before. So I remember like the basic components of the game and I do remember that it's fairly hard and that it's very easy to just run out of fuel. Like see right now we're already almost out of fuel. I need to go back and get some now before I basically just die. And I can go over here to basically sell the stuff and you see how we got some things so we can go ahead and sell that. And... We basically just do this over and over again. The hard part is, like everybody else, the instinct is to want to go deeper and deeper. But the deeper you go, the more dangerous it is, as once again, you're more likely to run out of fuel. So even right now, I'm kind of going a little deep. I might be making a mistake here. I think I'm going to grab these two and then I'm going to get out of here. Cargo bay full. Cargo bay is full anyway. See? All right, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Started getting a little dangerous. There we go, fill. Okay, let's go ahead and sell what we got again. We can go and sell all here. Now let's go take a look at what upgrades we got. So there's their save game. This is the junk shop. Welcome to the upgrade shop. If you're looking to enhance your machine, you come in the right place. Very cool. Now can I? Can you tell me? Whoa. Oh, up here. Okay, so we got the drill, the engine, the fuel tank, the radiator, the cargo bay. Is there cargo? Oh, radiator, cargo bay, and exit. Okay, so we got the stock drill. Oh, wait, no, this is the... We have the stock drill. This is a silveride, gold, emerald, ruby, diamond, amazonianite. Okay, let's see. What else can we get? The engine. I think the fuel tank is probably going to be the thing that we're going to go for probably first. The fuel tank is just so critical. Stock fan, okay. And then more loading space. Alright, noted. Now what's this? This is, I think this is just repairs, right? This is just repairs. Cool, F to use. R, okay, so when we buy these, we'll have to remember what, like, uh, button they are. Okay, very cool. Let's go ahead and continue mining. Now, the other thing about this game is you might just say, well, why don't you just build, like, a elevator, just like in Terraria, and just go as far as you can, and then just go back up to refuel. Um, so, you can do that, and actually, when I first started playing this game, that was my first instinct. The only problem with this game is, on occasion, um, earthquakes happen, and it basically resets the ground. So... You can make a elevator, but it often ends up being pretty useless as it just gets covered up. Hello? Can I sell my goods? Okay, first thing we're going to instantly do here is we're going to get a better fuel tank. This is 2,000. You know what? Maybe we'll just... Let's just save it for the 2,000 one, actually. Why... I don't know why I would waste $1,000 on... Or 750 on a tank where I could fairly easily get the $1,000 one, to be honest. So let's just go ahead and do that. And again, um, the ground is is going to be shaken up and kind of moved around when an earthquake hits. So a lot of this doesn't really matter that much. 
And the other thing you might be seeing me is being very careful with how I land. I'm not going to show you guys what it looks like, but you take damage very, very easily in this game from just hitting the ground. If you hit the ground for more than two blocks up, you take damage, and it's expensive to fix. So, um, I'm very careful when going towards the ground. Okay, cargo bay full. So that'll be something that you'll see, like, right there. Slow descent. Gotta be a little careful here. Let's go and sell all those. Let's refill our fuel while we're up here. Let's go kind of back down where we were mining because I think we were in a good little pocket right there. Same right here. This is a good pocket. So I want to continue here. Try to pick these up. And once we get to about a quarter fuel, we'll probably start heading back up here. Right, I think we'll start heading back up now or we're going to be in danger. Whoop, see, a little bit of danger there, but we made it. Let's just go and fill up our tank and then sell. I don't want to get accidentally caught with my pants down there. 19,000, okay, we almost have 2,000 for that new tank. We just got to grab a couple more minerals. And again, nice and steady. If you go any faster, you are going to hurt your little mining rig and you will die. Which is not very cash, if you ask me. Again, I don't, I don't know when the earthquakes happen. I just know that they do. I don't know if they're triggered by a certain depth. Oh, okay. See, like things like that are scary. When you're low on fuel and you get stuck like that. Am I dead? Whew, that was close, though. Let's go sell. And we can buy the bigger fuel pod here. So maybe we can have less of these worries here. Huge tank. There we go. So now we can maybe worry a little less about our fuel. It's still not going to just like magically get us unlimited fuel. But it's quite a bit more. Which is very handy. And again, what's important with this game is you really just want to be careful at all times. You don't want to have like one moment where your mind just kind of wanders and slips. Because you'll fall or you'll just like not pay attention to your fuel for one second and then all of a sudden you're in a lot of trouble and also the other important thing i feel like people just maybe do subconsciously but remember the route you came in from if you forget the route you came in from it's a lot harder to get back out and then all of a sudden you're playing you're playing a maze while also trying to get up to the surface oh cargo be full and um Playing those games is not a good idea, especially with this game. One minor, like, time of getting lost, and all of a sudden you're dead. So, let's go ahead and go back to the fuel, fill up our tank, sell. I think the next thing, we're going to get a bigger cargo hold because... Actually, let's go ahead and buy a bigger cargo hold now. Where's my cargo... Because honestly, like, the hull is fine. I'm not going to beat my thing up. I'm going to be careful. The engine is okay. Radiator. The cargo hold is the more important one. So, the important part right now, though, is we need to get some ores. Because if we don't, we're not going to have enough money to get fuel. So, actually, it's going to be a little important here to make sure to get up to the surface. Actually, um, I got to get up to the surface with enough time to gr to sell and then grab fuel. So I got to remember to do that. Okay, let's just go back up now. I just don't, I don't feel like playing with it right now. And this isn't a super mining rich area, so let's go and sell that, so we can run over, fill up our gas tank, which is only ten bucks actually. It's not horrible. Actually, let's grab these two pieces of copper right here while we're at it. And then the other thing that you have to keep in mind with this game is you technically can't dig upwards. And then you can't dig while flying. Those are the couple things that you just need to keep in mind. So if you get stuck, 
you really need to find a way that you've already made. Or one that you can kind of... Well, no, it's actually it. it you got to go through a hole that you've made. Unless you want to dig sideways towards a hole you already made, but you really can't dig straight up. So if you get stuck, you're kind of stuck, stuck. Let's, let's keep getting that good, good. We have a lot more room now to grab stuff, so... Um, you know what? Just for safety. There's no reason to just go back up. Grab more fuel. Again, really with this game, you just want to play safe. If you play safe, you can't die. And I say that and I hit something. And you could see how very easy it is to take damage here. If you play safe, there's no way for you to die. If you head up early, if you just... You know, waste a little fuel on just flying down slowly. All of these things will in turn slow down your progress, but you'll not die. Which is, in my opinion, probably the more important one. Because if you die, your game's over anyway, so what was the point of all of it? Let's go ahead and grab all of this. There's a lot of ore down here. Oh, but now, I'm getting the slight sense of feeling that I'm a little lost. So this is where I'm going to play maybe a little safer. I'm going to grab this last piece, and let's start heading up. I feel myself maybe getting a little lost. Okay, I think I think we're safe. Okay, we're safe. But, oh, okay. And because of that, I was a little, little too excited. We have to go fix our ship. I'm not risking a couple more hits. Alright, that wasn't as expensive as actually I thought it would be. There's the earthquake. Again, I don't know what triggers it, but now the ground is reset. Not totally reset, but kind of reset. Radiator. I still don't actually know. Oh, just te oh, this is just effectiveness. Okay. Force power. Let's buy that, and then let's buy the stock. F oh, this is. Oh, that's twenty thousand. Hull. Okay, we can buy a little bit more hull. All right, let's go ahead and go back to here. But you can see the ground isn't completely shook up. It's Most of our holes are still here. But it is switched up just a tiny bit. Go ahead and let me make sure. I'm going to try to build a little elevator here. Let's start right here. And we have enough money for a fuel up. So let's. I'm going to start the works of a elevator here. And again, it's going to be um, covered up by earthquakes here and there, but it's pretty easy to just kind of dig them back out. So let's go ahead and go down as far as we can here. Okay, got to keep an eye on our fuel here. I think we're good. Ooh, good, I see you're adapting well to the Martian soil. Here's a little something to help you on your way. I don't know what he gave me though. Okay, let's head up. Um, play safe here. I don't feel like maybe running out of fuel. Oh, he just gave me money. Okay, hey yo. The boy. Let's go ahead and sell what we got so we can continue mining. We didn't have a lot, but oh, there's another earthquake. Um, ah, mistakes have been made. Oh, because of the earthquake, he put their stuff in my way again. Alright. Guess we'll just have to dig through it. Just keep digging. Just keep digging. And again, we want to always make sure we have enough money to get fuel. Everything else is not vital. You know, if, if I buy an upgrade and get left with zero dollars and all of a sudden I can't refuel, I'm screwed. So... Fuel is more important to me than any upgrade. I always want to make sure I keep at least like two, three hundred dollars, which even two, three hundred dollars is a lot because I can fill up my tank for like twenty, thirty. But you know, you don't, you don't really want to take those chances. All right, let's keep digging. Got a little more fuel left. The one nice thing about building a, hel a elevator is the safety of you know you can't get lost. Instead of caving, you just 
you know, oh, okay, we're a little low on H, a little low on fuel. Let's head back up here. You, you know, you just go straight up. You know you can't get lost. Fill up our tank here. Let's sell what we got. How much money we got? 2,000? Okay. I think we'll save up for... We'll go past 2,000 and maybe we'll get that first... Um, that first cooler. The one that gives us more efficiency. I think that's what we're going to go for here. Okay, I'm just going to dig down here just because there's a lot of ore in this little area. Then we're going to go back and kind of start digging backwards. There we go. Then we'll slowly upgrade our machine. Is this gold? Goldium. you love to see it. I love how they renamed it from gold to goldium. Like, we all know it's gold, right? Like, you, you particularly have to rename it, but... Let's keep, keep, let's keep digging down. Yeah, keep an eye on our fuel. The farther we go, the more fuel we'll need to get back up, so... Let's grab this since we can. Let's grab this since we can. Let's head back up. No more chances. Head back up. Play safe. Yum. Okay. Pull up our tank for seven bucks. Okay, I think we're officially kind of safe to grab this radiator. Oh, that's what it's called, radiator. Five thousand. Can I just save up for this? Hmm. Dude, I think I'm gonna play a little dumb. I might save up for that five thousand dollar upgrade. I know that's a little dumb, but I think I'm just gonna do it. Again, right now we're safe to kind of just fall, but when earthquakes come around, we'll have to be a bit more careful with our descent to make sure we don't just smack in a rock and die instantly. I just I want to get deep. I want to find more valuable ore. But I think I might need a faster, maybe, engine for that. Congrats, you reached 1,000. I've wired you a bonus for your excellent work. We're picking up some heavy vibrations. They seem to be causing earthquakes. Okay. Oh, hey, we can buy that thing now because we got 5,000 from the boy. Okay, well, let's still grab as much as we can. But then we'll head back up. Just keep trying to go as deep as possible. I want to make sure to keep an eye on it. Okay, I think I'm going to head back up. It might be a little early. At least, actually, I definitely think it's a little early. But... Never too early in this game. Okay. Woo! second I come up from the ground, there's the earthquake, so we'll have to kind of redig a lot of the things that we did. That's okay. Alright, give me that, uh, give me that better radiator, huh? Hello? Radiators. There we go. Bing bonk. Okay. Let's go ahead and just refuel one more time before we head out. Okay, now we gotta watch out because of the earthquake. Yeah, see right there. There's going to be ground underneath us now. And new ore, which is nice. But if we keep digging down, we can hopefully just outrun the earthquakes. Although, I don't know if maybe the game is made where the deep, the faster I go down, the more earthquakes happen to kind of stop me from it. I don't know if, that, if the game has that level of detail. But they sure seem to ha happen more often the deeper I go. I'm definitely going to have to come down and redig this a couple times. Because we're kind of already cheesed on fuel right now. But I got a little more in me. Um, okay, we got to head back up now. I think, I think we'll be fine. We should be. Oh, oh yeah, we're more than fine. Unfill up our tank. I'm not going to even bother emptying my tank right now 
or my cargo because we didn't really grab that much and it's always a good idea when you're digging down to just keep an eye on the amount of feet you're down because when you fall you know you can basically fall straight down until a certain depth as long as the earthquake obviously so right then I knew I was around 700 so I basically fell to around 600 without even worrying about hitting anything because I knew there'd be nothing in the way all right, I was trying to get deep enough to where I can maybe start seeing some uh, some new ground here. Also, gotta take a sip of water while I'm at it. Apparently, I still see just copper and iron and gold. I don't see much else. Okay, one more dig and then we'll head back up. All right, let's head back up. I'll definitely cut it a little closer with this one, but I think we'll still have plenty of time to spare. Oh, yeah. Okay, and let's definitely sell our stuff this time. Okay, and now we can fall down to around 1,000 with no worries of an earthquake. Okay, so 1,000, and from here, we want to just be a little bit more careful. There we go. I will grab... Or that's right off the edges right there. Why not? Alright, we're at 1,250. Curious to see when we'll start seeing new ores. Well, let's just keep digging. Just keep digging. Just keep digging. I will grab these two just because they're close. That's going to slow down my progression, but... We also, while doing this, we also just need to keep track of our money. Because if I get upgrades, it'll be even easier to do this. Okay. One more down, and then I'm going up. That's a dinosaur. Oh, and I saw treasure. Okay, so it seems like after 1,200 is when it might be getting a little exciting. I know, I know I'm low. I know I'm low. I'm right here. I'm right here. Don't worry. David's got you. Drop off our stuff. How much money we got? Not enough for an upgrade just yet. Okay, no earthquake, right? So we should be good to fall basically all the way down to 1,200. Alright, ooh! Maybe I took it a little close there, but... Let's see, what happens when I hit bone? Ooh, dinosaur. Okay, so... I was wondering, does that damage my machine or give me money? That gives me money, which is nice. Ooh! Hey, yo, that is a lot of money. Oh, Lord Almighty, let's find more of those treasure things. That gives me a lot of money. Okay. Say less. We're definitely going to get an upgrade when we go back up because we kind of just hit a very minor jackpot right there. I know for a fact I can't dig through these boulders, though. I know that for a fact. So our elevator kind of gets messed up right here. Oh, wait, what is that? That's blue, and I want it. But first, let's head back up. Let's refuel. What is going on? Did I mess up my elevator? Oh, I totally did not listen to what I, what I just said to myself that I had to move sideways. I'm like, I was confused. I'm like, did an earthquake hit while I was down there? And like, all of a sudden, I'm going to be trapped. Okay. Oh, the earthquake. Okay, well... We'll have to redig our way down. Let's go ahead and go to the upgrades, though. Let's see if we can get anything nice. Maybe a better drill? Maybe an emerald drill? How much is 20? Okay, we're going to go ahead and purchase the emerald drill here. We don't really need a better hull, to be honest. We could buy that new engine. Cargo bay? I already have the medium bay here. Hmm. I'm going to go ahead and purchase this. I think that's going to be a good investment. Let's go ahead and refuel. And I think next we maybe... Do we up... Oh, that's a good drill. Oh, look at us go. Do we maybe go for a bigger fuel cell already? But I know I spent 5000 on this one, so I'm, it's going to be a little expensive. Yeah, i got to be careful all the way down. 
No mistakes. One mistake could end up killing us. This drill is much faster than I thought it would be, though. Now, I wonder, does this drill take up more fuel? I'm guessing it doesn't. But so far, we're kind of almost down. Oh, okay. Gonna have, after when we go back up, I'm also going to heal here. I'm not very close to dead, but I just don't want to take that chance. But see, we're already kind of at 1,200 with this new drill, and we lost less fuel than normal, so I'm guessing we're not using up more fuel. This is simply just a speed upgrade, which is real nice, actually. Let's keep digging. Let's keep digging. We're down to 1,300. Look at us go. Okay, there's a dinosaur bone over there. Okay, I think it's time to head back up. Well, we, I might go over and dig towards the dinosaur bone just because I know that's just basically a free thousand dollars. Maybe. I don't know what every bone is. I've only dug one up so far. Alright, we came up a little early. But, no problemo. Let's go ahead and clear our inventory while we're here. Okay, and I know we're basically good to fall up until 1,200. Okay. Yeah, I'm just trying to be careful here. Where's that dinosaur? Where'd it go? Oh, up here. Okay. Like, I know I saw it. Where did it go? I'm gonna have to go a little bit of a weird route around, but... There we go. $1,000. Easy. Keep digging. Plenty of fuel. Oh, see, this is kind of juice, though. I'm gonna grab all of these ores right here. I don't know what that middle one is, the blue one. Platinum. Oh, okay. Well then, you know what? Let me just... There's a lot of ore right here. I might as well just grab it all. There's no reason to just waste all this ore that's just sitting in front of me. Let's kind of head back up here. Is this my elevator? Okay, this is my elevator. Okay. Well then, let's... uh. You know what? Let's play safe. Let's head back up. No reason to get greedy right now. We're doing good. We're making good progress. No reason to do something dumb right now. Hopefully no earthquake comes. Ooh, that was a juicy little payout right there. Hopefully no earthquake comes right now. Okay, start slowing it down. Make sure we don't do anything drastic here. Alright, so we're going to hit a rock. So we're going to have to go sideways here. We'll just have to keep... Ah! Oh, did I totally forget to fix my hole? When I went up last time? Okay. Oh, God, my... Oh, God, the eyes. Alright. And one more reminder. I have not played this game. Like, extensively. So, genuinely, no idea what that means little spooky to be honest no idea what that means at all hopefully I don't run into something that kills me hoping okay one more I think it's time to head back up yeah it's time to head back up and just playing it safe 4,000 in the bank more fuel than you could ask for. Yeah, but now it's taking, a, it's taking a little hot minute to get back up, so... Let's go ahead and do that. Oh, another earthquake. Okay, well, we'll have to redig it. It is what it is. Let's go ahead and sell our stuff. Let's go ahead and... No, I don't want to do that, but I do want to repair myself. Okay, let's head back. Refuel again. And we gotta go slow. Gotta redig our way down here. And it might be a good investment to maybe start hella a elevator elsewhere now. But let's just keep going down here for a little while longer. And see what we can do. Ah! I just I just fixed my hole and of course I broke it instantly. We're fine. That's not a whole lot of health. It's just I'm just so hyper vigilant with this game. This game is a little spooky, so. All 
All right, we're at back at a thousand here, about a little over a half of a fuel tank. All right, we'll go up and fix our hull again. I'm be I'm getting sloppy, I'm being a little sloppy, which isn't good. Got to put my sloppiness away. This is not the type of game you want to become sloppy with. All right, we're almost back down to one thousand five hundred. I think we were just around 2,000 when we left. So, I'm going to have to dig 500 more on the way back down. A little more. Okay. Eh, one more. Alright, time to head back up. So, we were around 1,600. Noted. Oh, we're going to cut it a little closer this time than normal. We're, we're going to be fine. We're cutting it a little closer than normal. Okay. Is there... Fuel tank. What? We're using this right now, right? This is 5,000. Go ahead and purchase it. It's a little scary because... I only have $174 for fuel. But I really should be able to get enough ore to refill my tank. I should. Okay, but now we got a much larger fuel tank. So we, we'll be able to go down for a much longer amount of time. And we'll definitely be able to break our 2,000 record here. It was 2,000 something. I forgot the exact number. But we'll definitely be able to break it as long as, yeah, as long as rocks don't get really get in our way here. <gasps> That's a new L that's a new ore right there. I want to know what that is. I want to know what you are. Einsteinium, okay. That seems to be expensive. Alright, so we'll go here. Right around the rocks. Alright, we're at 2,000. This is where we were really earlier. Oh, I'm surprised to find another signal. I'm the only miner who hasn't disappeared in the past three years. Next week, finally get to retire wealthy to my moons of Jupiter with my wife. Hmm. I hope he gets to do that. I have a feeling he won't, but I hope he does. Oh, Lord. Okay. This elevator's taking a turn and a half. Again, gotta make sure you don't get lost. If you get lost... You can get in a sticky situation. I guess I'm just going to mine a couple of things on the sides here. I'll, I'll come back down when I have fresh fuel. Let's just get a couple of these ores. And then we can head back up. Um. Oh yeah, let's grab these two. Grab this and then we'll go back up. Alright, let us head. Oh. A little scary there. I thought I was about to get lost. Again, it might seem like very smooth brained of me. But. I just don't like taking chances. Right, let's go ahead and uh, sell our stuff. Oh, that was pricey. Ayo. Ah, another earthquake. We just got deep again. Alright, well, their bigger fuel tank. Another one? What in the world? With our fuel tank, it shouldn't be a problem to basically just run back down there. If anything, maybe it'll move a couple of those a couple of those rocks out of the way. I don't think I've seen two earthquakes happen in a row. Maybe we got a little too deep and the game was like, um no. You're not allowed that deep sir all right we're already at uh already at almost a thousand so we're we're, we're going we're, we're going quick our fuel is keeping up with us and here's what i'm thinking do we get a whole upgrade next because our fuel is good our drill is good i'm just a little scared of it getting dinged up on accident i think that might be the next one i buy it's definitely the least important out of all the upgrades, just because I'm just, I'm a fairly careful person. Yeah, I got dinged up a couple times, but nothing crazy so far. 
But I'm just scared of that one in a million where I just like lose um, focus for a second and then just ruin the whole thing. So I'm thinking in that instance I might want to just go grab that upgrade. Alright, but for now let's just see how deep we can go again. We're back down to around 2,000. Alright, here's a rock. So right now we just gotta remember we're one to the we're one to the right, so go up. Oh, so many more rocks, dude. Alright, let's keep going. Just have to remember our path here. What is that? Ooh, fifty thousand! Oh Lord Almighty, that is expensive. Oh, I wanted to grab that. Okay, let's grab these two and then get out of here. Let's get out of here. I don't want to take any chances right now. We'll have to go one to the left here. All right, and we should be a straight shot home from here. 50,000. Whoa, we kind of got lucky on that one. That's going to get us a solid upgrade. Sheesh. Okay. I feel like mining is useless, man. I just got to look for these artifacts. They're paying out money, money. 2,900. Screw that. We just got 50k from that guy. All right. Cargo bay. I'm currently using. See, all, see, all of this seems cheap all of a sudden. Radiator. Um. Well, actually, even a lot of these are still kind of expensive. What are, this, this is this? What we're using? Let's use the Titanic tank, right? But before I do that. Oh, I'm using a really bad engine right now, aren't I? Alright, uh, what is this? 100. Okay, let's go ahead and buy this. That'll be actually nuts. Do I buy this? Or do I buy this fuel tank? I'm gonna buy this fuel tank. Also, don't we have gadgets over here we can buy? Oh, yeah. Oh, this is... This seems very useful. Oh, I might have to buy one of those for safety. Simply for safety. Oh, I probably should have just bought this. Hmm. This might have been a better buy, but it's okay. Press F to use. I'm going to buy a couple of those. Okay. So we got to remember F and M. Those are our two saviors right now. F and M. One by fuel. Another earthquake hit, which is kind of sad. So back down to going slow. So we upgraded our engine and our f fuel, right? Our engine and fuel. Hopefully we can find another one of those absolutely giga artifacts. And maybe we can upgrade our drill along with our hull. If I get another 50k, that's the thing that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to put 20k into the drill and 20k into the hull here. So our, our fuel is good. And again, extra fuel is F. We got two of those. Or instantly teleport to safety is M. Those are going to be our saviors currently. And again, realistically, hopefully we'll never have to use them. Those are just going to be like in dire circumstances. I screw up horribly. But hopefully we won't really have to use those. But at the same time, the reason they're such a good purchase, because they're kind of expensive at 10k, but we won't ever have to rebuy them again. So they'll just stay there and we won't have to touch them. Unless we screw up. Alright, we're almost back to 2,000 here. And I saw the good stuff was coming up around 3,000, so... Let's have to run back. Okay, see, I don't I already don't like what's going on here. But I have a lot of fuel, so I'm just going to keep going. Famous last words. Okay, it's okay. 
keep going. We're fine for now. This elevator is kind of messy, though. It's not as pristine as I usually like it. I usually like it to be a little cleaner. See, okay, there's an artifact there. I want to grab that artifact. I think let's go ahead and grab this, and then we'll head back up. 10,000, okay, not as expensive. Let's grab this, and then let's go ahead and head back up here. The one nice part is, is going upwards, you don't ding your head. That's the one nice part. If... If upwards you dinged your head and took hull damage, that would be a little scary for me. Because then going upwards is even, you know, more dangerous. Luckily, the game didn't make it that way. Alright, oh, let's of course clear our inventory. Alright, and let's go ahead and head back down to our kind of jank hole here. And I totally forgot what our depth was, so I'm just going to be careful the whole way down this time around. I forgot what our depth was. I don't feel like dying. Okay, that's where we were. We couldn't get through this rock, so we came down here. Couldn't get through that rock, so we kept digging this way. Okay. We continue on. Oh! Dang it, took more damage. But, no, it's eight ain't so. I wanted to get to that, but it doesn't look like it's going to let me, sadly. I need help. I can't feel my legs. Oh, God, he's coming. Oh, please. Ooh. I don't know what that means. And I'm slightly scared. But we're going to keep going here. Treasure. Gimme, gimme. How much? Fifth five. Oh, okay, that's not a whole lot, but but we'll take five thousand. What are we at? Um, see, I think we made it past three thousand before, so we're not even at our like max depth. We've made it farther than this before. Let me go ahead and grab that. We have so much fuel that I'm not gonna worry too much right now. Let's just keep going. Okay, eh, more rocks. Slightly annoying. Okay, let's see, where are we at? I think I might head back up in a minute here. I'm gonna head back up. I don't feel... All of a sudden, I don't feel as safe. Because we have to make so many of these little... Little ding turns. Um, yes, there we go. Okay. Yeah, because of all those minor turns, I don't feel as safe. So I want to take a little bit of less risk on those. And what we're also going to do... Let's go and refuel. Go sell our stuff. This one's always a weird building. That won't really let me do what I need to do. We're going to go ahead and upgrade our... Drill. We'll upgrade our drill. Let's also upgrade, or not upgrade, let's just fix our machine here. And fill up our fuel. Alright, and back down we go. Once again, I don't really know where we were at, but... I'm s I, okay, this time I swear I'll remember where we were at. Okay, 1,300. 1,400. Okay, so we're... Oh, we were almost at, like... Okay, we're at 1,800. Okay, noted for that. Dang it. So we can drop down 1,800 instantly. Alright, David. Calm down. Slow. Slow, slow, slow. Stop dinging your uh, miner up, homie. Chill. Okay. Another rock. Okay, this is where we left off. We got a new new miner so hopefully this sh should be theoretically this should be a real good miner 
So far, it seems kind of similar to the last one, to be honest, but... Can this one dig through rocks? No. Even this one cannot dig through rocks. Noted. It seems like, man, our fuel's already, like, somehow gone. I mean, oh. How are you making it out, kid? I know you're new here, so I thought I'd give you a tip. Make sure you don't neglect your radiator. I ran into a lava pocket a few moments ago, but my twin turbines dissipated oh, heat amazingly. And my hull was barely damaged. Probably saved my life. Okay. So they told me to focus on my radiator. I did buy one radiator early on, but i they're right. Maybe I should upgrade it. Did I buy the second radiator one? I don't actually remember. Let's grab this just because money. There we go. Keep going. We're at 3,000 now. I think this is kind of where we were at earlier. It took us a little longer to... Oh, that's a lava patch, ain't it? it? Took us a little longer to get down here this time because of the whole... Of, like, the pattern, but... Emeralds. That should give me a lot of money, shouldn't it? Okay, that, that should sell for quite a bit. Alright, another lava pocket. Go ahead and avoid that. I don't know if I have to, like, touch it to get hurt, but I'm just... Not gonna even go near it. Once again, congrats, you've made it farther than I anticipated. Anyway, I've sent you another bonus. Watch out for the natural gas pockets. They're undetectable and highly explosive. One more thing, your altimeter is only rated for a depth of around 6,000. After that, you'll need to turn back. Really, it's just too dangerous. Interesting. Okay, so... I shouldn't go past 6,000? interesting okay i'm getting i'm getting a little uh a little risky here let's head back up we've got a lot of little wine little pockets to go through here i shouldn't i really shouldn't be this careless especially if i accidentally get stuck somewhere okay this is the last pocket i think from here yep it's up from here so oh psych it's not up from there Oh yeah, we'll have enough fuel. But I am leaving at good times, so I'm happy with that. Go ahead and grab fuel first. Let's go ahead and sell what we got. It's a good value. We got some emeralds that time around, so that was some good value. Let's fix our stuff real quick. What is this? M? This is R. F R. Yeah, I don't think I need that right now. Hello? Junk shop. Mm, what rate are we using? We're using the single, right? What is this? 20%? 60? What did I say is lacking? Oh, our hull, right? We should probably... I don't think we've upgraded our hull once. Let's go ahead and get the platinum hull here. And we won't have to upgrade that for a while. So we got the ruby drill. Platinum hull. I think we've got most things up to their $20,000 version, really, except our huge bay. But I, I don't feel like I ran out of storage space. I'm going to leave that for now. Really, it's... We just need to buy a radiator. You know, I'm just going to go ahead and purchase that. That might not be the smartest purchase, but I just did it. So, I'm going to fill up our tank here and... <gasps> wait, wait, wait. There was an earthquake. Was there not? don't remember was there an earthquake wait it doesn't look like it it got scared for a moment there i'm like um should i really be just falling but we can make it down to 1800 correct yes Let's see if we can just make it down this way we're good we're good again now i don't know if i should be going so deep Clearly, there's some form of danger because people are, like, dying out here. But you know what I'm thinking? Hear me out. If something bad happens, I press M, right? If I see something scary coming, I press M, and I just get out of here. Call it a day. What in the world? What did I get hit? Okay, let's keep going down. 
Maybe we can make it down to 6,000 and just kind of see what's up. See some emeralds over there. I think I'm just going to run and grab those. Might be just a good thing to grab. Yeah, so... I'm a little less worried just because we have that tool on us. Let's keep going downwards. A lot more lava pockets now, but... Here's what I'm wondering. The farther we go, is it more val is it more profitable? Because I feel like now we're just... We're getting less ore, to be honest. And things like the artifacts, are they down here too? Or are they just in that 3,000 section, you know? Alright, we're making it down to the 4,000 though. Let's grab all these things while we're here. Alright, 4,000 feet. There we go. Let's grab those emeralds. Kind of go back here. Okay, another stone. Okay, I'm going to grab this emerald, and then we're going to head back up, actually. There's two emeralds. Trapped in a crevice. Earthquake damaged my drill, and I'm out of fuel. This will probably be my last chance. Bro, is this the same homie that was going to retire? No shot, dude. Alright, now we're just playing. We're playing dangerous. Actually, I'm might have screwed myself here I'm a little deep I have extra fuel so I'm not worried about that but I rather I was planning not to use it maybe I can still get out just have to go through a lot of these little holes okay almost almost at the clearing here Okay, we're we're at the clearing. Okay, we're we're here. We're officially at the clearing here. You know what? It was only two thousand dollars. I'm just gonna use it. You know what? Then if that's the case, let's head back down to like here. Let's keep digging for a little while. Just keep digging. Again, I... That was maybe an overreaction. But it's literally $2,000. It's not really that much. And I just don't feel like dying right now. Ouch. Let's just... Um, let's make that $2,000 back by grabbing a few ores. And we call it a day. What do you say? I think that's smart. We're not that far underground, so... We're not really at risk of losing much right now. Cargo bay full. Okay, that's the first time that's happened in a very long time. Let's head back up. Sell our stuff and uh, we'll, I guess, continue trying to go into the depths here. Up our tank. Let's see, do we, get, do we got a lot to sell? 31,000. Look at us go. We're absolutely balling. Alright, let's buy a little more fuel. And no earthquake yet. So, let's go ahead and jump back down here. Alright, we'll start being careful around 1,700 here. Ow, of course, I still hit myself. Go as deep as we can, huh? I ain't scared of nothing. Except something that can kill me, but... Slowly but surely, slowly but surely, we'll get back down there. No rush. We mining away, we digging, we chilling. Ouch. Oh, can't go on that side. Now I'm kind of glad we bought that new hole. All of a sudden, I'm kind of getting dinged up. Left and right. We'll have to buy more extra fuel when we get back up, too. I think this is where we were at, right? Yeah. Well, might as well dig near the emeralds then, huh? 
Set back up here. There you go. Oh, we dug toward another rock, it seems. Well, I guess it depends on what our goal here is. Do I want to get loot or do I want to get down far? Right now, I kind of just want to get down far. So if I can grab the loot, I will. I'm just going to ignore those emeralds because right now, I just kind of just want to get far down. Yeah, we're at 4,000. Really, if I was smart, I'd also start digging sideways to kind of just try to look for artifacts. I'm just very curious at what's down at these very, very low depths. Oh, baby, this is it. I hit the mother load. I'm rich. I'm filthy rich. Hey, what the... No, it got me. No, God. Sorry, my guy. Okay, so noted. There's something out here baiting people, right? Gotta be careful of that. Ooh, that looks expensive. I don't know what that is, but it looks expensive. Ruby. Okay, I think it's time to head back up. Probably overstayed our welcome once again, and I might have to use my last fuel. Like, extra fuel, but... At the same time, I've also got... $30,000, and I'm not exactly poor. So I really shouldn't have to worry about it too much. If I have to use it, I use it. Just a little bit of it. It's just $2,000. A little extra fuel. And at the way we're running right now, we will definitely have to use it. Let's just go ahead and... Oh, that's expensive. Alright, we're going straight towards that. Easy 50k. Yeah, see, when I see things like that, I'm going to go for him. So in a sense, it was a good thing that I used the fuel there because it let me grab something real expensive. All right, but I'm still almost 3,000 feet underground. I shouldn't just chill. But I... Oh, um, can I get to that? I feel like I can get to that artifact right there. It's not very far. Got it. Martian Skeleton. Right, let's head back up. Yum, 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 yum. Bonk. Alright. Came out with 92000 We could potentially get a $100,000 upgrade next. There's something that we should be able to do. Okay. Hit my hull there, but I wasn't really worried about it. So we can just repair it pretty easily. Let's buy four of those. Hmm. I want to buy one of these. And I want to see what it does. Other oh, earthquake. Okay. Fair. Fair. Let's see. Cargo bay. We're using the gigantic one, right? Let's just buy this one in the meanwhile. Just in the meanwhile. Oh, let's... Did we sell our stuff yet? No, we didn't. Ayo, 44000 Man, we could have just bought a $100,000 upgrade then. It's okay. Alright, once again, we have been earthquake, so... I'm gonna have to dig really all the way back down, but... What the one nice thing about these earthquakes, I was actually looking forward to one because I didn't like where the rocks were placed on our elevator, so it's actually not a bad thing that maybe this earthquake shook up a couple of the rocks so we can get a little deeper more reliably. You know what I'm saying. Ouch. Keep going, keep digging. Just keep digging. Just keep digging. We have almost an hour on the recording. Sheesh, we've been doing this for a minute. Just keep going down. Set a thousand five hundred. Just 
Here we go. Back down to 2,000. All right, this rock is still in our way. Slightly annoying. It looks, seems like that rock either moved or I don't know. But we've got a slightly better path so far, which is nice. We're down to almost 2,300 with only a single rock movement. Maybe we'll be able to get down to 3,000 without any rocks. The only thing we'll really have to watch out for is those lava pockets. Let's keep going. Yeah, we're, we're making it fairly far. Alright. Hopefully an earthquake doesn't screw this up too fast, because this is this is a nice hole compared to the other one. I say that, and then there's one rock in the way, which kind of sucks. But hey, two rocks just to 3,000 feet. Oh, four rocks. Well, we can't we can't be perfect, can we? Okay, never mind. There's now all of a sudden a lot of rocks. Still not as bad though. Ah, okay, now it's getting as bad. And I'm still very curious to see what that bomb does. But before I use it... Like, I'm just... I don't know... Okay, let's head back up. You know what we should do? We should buy the dynamite first to see what it does. Because I don't want to waste the $10,000 one if not needed, you know, to waste it. There we go. Okay, so we can drop all the way to around 2,000 before getting dinged up. And we actually left at a decent time because our fuel just now got low. So we're creating some good habits as far as our fuel goes. I feel like $48 for that isn't very expensive. I'm really going to quickly just repair my thingy. We could also... We could... Wait, how much is this? 50? Huh. 60% effective. We could buy that. 100 liters. How much is it? 60? Almost doubles our liter liter edge. Hmm. I think I'm going to do this. I'm going to go ahead and purchase this. 150, yeah. Let's go ahead and just purchase that. I think that's a decent purchase. Alright, so again, we can drop down to around 2,000 instantly. And oh man, our fuel is going to go down very slow now. Alright, we're around 2,000, so slow down. Slow down, slow down. Oh yeah, we're going to go almost down to 3,000 here. Alright, so I'll remember if the next time I can drop down to 1,000 and 3,000. Okay, and then this is where we kind of start hitting some rocks, but no biggie, no biggie at all. With our new fuel, <gasps> there's a 50k. We're going to grab that instantly. Okay, so these 50Ks are even down here. So they're they're seen as low as 3,000. I'm looking to go for a world record here. I'm looking to go down to 6K. So our fuel I should be able to get us there. Maybe we'd have to upgrade our drill to be a little faster, but ow, I was... Not paying attention there. That was completely my fault. Alright, just keep digging. Just keep digging. No rocks for a little while now. Interesting. Ah, I need to stop talking. Okay. We're at... 4,000. Let's see if we see anything nuts around here. 
I don't see any new ores so far. Nothing crazy, at least. I might be a little cheeky and start taking some of these little off-roads. I know I said I shouldn't do that, but I've just got so much fuel. But I think we're, we're, we're kind of safe to do it. We shouldn't be too worried about it. Might as well grab these emeralds while we're here. Okay, more emeralds. Oops, I did not mean to go that way. Almost to 5,000. Ooh, rubies. Should probably grab those, right? I feel like that's a good investment to grab. A lot of rubies down here. Ooh, that is a lot of rubies. Yeah, once we get to... Where are we, around 5,000? Dinosaur bones. I almost feel like... Are those even worth to get, though? <gasps> diamonds. I see you, diamonds. I see you. I'm coming for you. Just don't tell me my cargo is full. That's my fear here. What is this? Silverium? Okay, that's not very good. Hmm. You know what I might do? I might use my M here, just because we're so deep and we got so much. Let's just keep going down. Screw it. We'll use our ten thousand dollar thing. Because we've just we have a lot of money right now. I think it's justifiable at the moment. To just keep digging down. What happened? What happened? Did I hit like a gas pocket? What? No way. I just spent an hour on that, dude. Oh, Lord. Yo, that sucks. I guess it just means I'll have to try again at some point. Dang. I think I hit a gas pocket. What's this game called again? What's it called? Mother load. Okay. Mother load gas pockets. Whoa, they turn up after 4,750. The problem with that one just killed me instantly. Lava damage. The Holy Terror of Mars. This will result in death unless equipped with at least Einsteinium Hall. Wow. Okay, noted. We'll have to try again and avoid gas pockets this time.